Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2018-19 Panini National Treasures Basketball. Four box, pick your team at number 19. A very big thank you to all of these folks right here for getting your uh, teams straight up. Appreciate that. And we got to do that, excuse me, we got to do that number block for the Dallas Mavericks. So, a big thank you to these folks right here for getting into the Dallas Mavericks random number block for this break. There it is. Oh, there's all the details right there. All right, good luck. Let's randomize each list. Three and a one, four times. Two, three, and a one, fourth and final time. After four times, we've got Ken down to John. Let's go to this the Dallas Mavericks tab. Three and a one, four times for the numbers. One, two, two. Random.org. Checked out early today. A little wheel still spinning on the tab there. I'm going to wait for it. It's the longest one ever. Come on, Ram.org. Oh, there it is. Two. So three and a one, four times. Two, three, and four. Man. There's four times right there. So four down to five. All right, so Ken, you have four and three, Eric with nine, Ken with one, Eric with two, Kevin with zero. Any and all Dallas Mavericks redemptions will go to you, including one of one redemptions. Fred with seven and eight, Ken with six, and John, last bot mojo, five. All right, so good luck to this crew right here as well. Let's print. We can finally rip open this case of NT basketball. All right, folks. So that's just for the, this is just for the Dallas Mavericks. Set that aside over here. And here is the final printout right here. So thanks everybody who got their teams straight up. Really appreciate it. Ken with that last Bon Mojo Warriors. All right, good luck folks. We did a case earlier. Looked pretty nice. It's NT. It's always, almost always nice. So let's hope this one follows that same trend of niceness. And TJ wants to know what, what we what we want to chip away at. He's, he's curious. What should we do next? got a quick divisional break to do right after this and then after that I don't know what we're doing after that we'll go through some orders I see some orders coming in a couple here and there all right good luck everybody love this stuff Mothro what's going on Nick wants to do that basketball mixer. Yeah, we can keep the hoops trend going. And 
there's a redemption on the bottom. And our first plate is Carmelo Anthony. Where's where does Melo end up? Lakers probably. <laughs> where where where's uh where's Kawhi gonna go, folks? Has he signed yet with my Lakers? Getting nervous now. Um, that is Nick's edition, and that will go to Cody. Cody, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop whoop. Forty-four out of ninety-nine, Lonzo Ball. And that is for Ken, who has my Lakers. Former Laker. There's Anthony Hardaway. Out of ninety-nine. Eight out of ninety-nine for the Orlando Magic. That goes to Tony. Game war material. We've got Hassan Whiteside, former Miami Heat. Two out of 99. Miami Heat making some changes to their team, adding some pieces. Kevin G with Miami. Let's see where they end up. Timeline relic, Tony Parker from his time in Charlotte. 67 out of 99. That's for. Oh, it's also for Kevin and the Hornets. He's heating up. And to Tony Parker's former team, there's Doc Rivers. 20 out of 25, three-color retro materials. That's pretty cool. That is for Tony and the Spurs. Slightly larger top loader for this. There you go, game more material as well, Doc Rivers. Pushing for Kawhi Leonard as we speak. Treasured signatures, 48 out of 99. Charles Scott, Boston Celtics, old school Celtic, going to Ken Goldberg. Uh, that is a Oppo Joe Mojo. We got Derek Harper for the Mavs. Peerless signatures, that's 75 out of 99. Number five goes to uh, that goes to John McD. There you go, John, on the board. Got a nice. Uh, he's got a nice autograph. Now more Celtics. That's Paul Pierce, thirty-eight out of forty-nine. Paul Pierce for Ken. The rookie patch and autograph is Mitchell Robinson for the New York Knicks. That's going to be for Cody. What's up, Dawson? Who do I think Kawhi will sign with? I wish I knew. Obviously, I hope he signs with my Lakers. That's what the heart wants. The head thinks... The head thinks that maybe he'll end up, uh, I think he might end up back with the Raptors. That doesn't sound too crazy. All right, next box. But who knows? Who knows? I should just have, I should just have uh, Woj's Twitter page up and just, just wait for something to happen there. Um, there are odds. There are odds, but I feel like they're changing all the they they like change every day. I think a couple days ago it was like the Lakers were the favorite, and 
And then Clippers were a favorite, the Raptors were a favorite, and I feel like it's just going all over the place. Box two. I mean, yeah, there's there's a good chance that he uh, that he stays in Canada. So I mean, I don't see why not. Maybe he thinks, hey, let's run it back, and he signs like a short term deal, and then tries free agency again. There's the plate for the uh, Orlando Magic, Aaron Gordon. That goes to Tony. Tony, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. Forty-six out of ninety-nine. Rudy Gobert for the Jazz. John Hooten with the Jazz. Jazz did some interesting things. They've got some good pieces. They re they just re-signed a. Looks like they signed Emmanuel Mudiay for a one-year deal. Joel Embiid has new teammates. Rudy Gobert goes to John. Joel Embiid goes to uh, Kevin G and the Sixers. Biography materials, 24 out of 99. So the Sixers could be a really gritty defensive team. Retro materials, 71 out of 99. Larry Johnson. Charlotte, Kevin G with that one too. He's heating up. Game worn material. Victor Oladipo, 54 out of 99. I think Pacers made a move too, right? Oh, the Pacers. I know the Pacers added another piece. Who did the Pacers add? Eric with the Pacers, but I know Oladipo is getting some help. There's Timeline Relic. That's a good looking one. 4 out of 10. Detroit Pistons. That's going to go to Eric Bailey. Game War Materials. Jersey Autograph, Jose Calderon. 13 out of 99, another piston for Eric. He's heating up. The Sixers, Mothro, they lost out on, or Jimmy Butler didn't re-sign with them. But they're, uh, I think they re-signed Tobias Harris. They added... Well, then they added uh, Al Horford. I think they re -signed, They signed him, too. 40 out of 99, Miles Turner. That's right. That is young to the Pacers. Speaking of the Pacers. So Pacers with a healthy Oladipo could be interesting. Erickson Sala with the Miles Turner jersey and auto. And 5 out of 10, NBA greats. Larry Bird, Ken Goldberg with the Celtics. And some that some of that Oppo Joe Mojo. No, was it Thaddeus Young to the Bulls, says Mike Tower? Then who went to the Pacers? Someone went to the Pacers. That was like a solid addition. I'm blanking on it for some. There's just too many things happening. Ray Allen for the Heat. 17 out of 49. If the Lakers don't get Kawhi, then maybe they can lure Ray Allen out of retirement. There's Ray Allen for the Miami Heat. Kevin G with that. Right, Nick, I think that I do remember. So the Jimmy Butler, I'm sure, was some sort of sign and trade, which got Josh Richardson to the Sixers as well. Oh, a lot of moves happening. A lot of moves. No, you know what the Pacers added? I, I just looked it up. Malcolm Brogdon. Mm -hmm. 
And the Bucks had opted to re-sign Chris Middleton for big money. And all sorts of crazy things happening in, in NBA free agency. We've got Jared Allen for the Nets. Jared Allen's going to have some new teammates, Eric. Eric Sansala. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! Jared Allen, DeAndre Jordan, KD in a year. Kyrie now. Karis LeVert, etc., etc. There's Dennis Schroeder, 9 out of 99 for OKC. That goes to Lionel. We got DeAndre, 8 and 78 out of 99. It's a relic for Ken and the Suns. What's up, Gavin? Yeah, it's been a little bit. Yeah, I'd like to do that museum. That museum would be pretty fun to do tonight. Yeah, we got all sorts of things on the website, folks. I see about a handful of orders coming in, so we'll go through those orders after this and then see what direction we're going in. There is Kyrie Irving in his Celtics gear. That'll still go to the Celtics. Ken with the C's. Yeah. And D'Angelo Russell. So the Ke Kevin Durant deal, I think, was technically a sign-in trade as well. So they got D'Angelo Russell coming back to the Warriors, and he got paid. But a lot of people seem to be saying that, that D'Angelo Russell is uh, is going to be a trade piece more than an actual player for the team. Don't know. Orlando Magic, Terrence Ross, 99 out of 99. That'll be for Tony. Nicola Batum, Jersey, game gear. That goes to 57 out of 99. That goes to Charlotte. That's for Kevin G. There's uh, Ryan Brokoff for the Dallas Mavericks. 30 out of 99. That goes to zero. Kevin G. He's on fire. Number zero in the Dallas Mavericks random number block. If your favorite player leaves via trade or free agency, do you still follow them? I don't. Not as, not as, not as closely. There's Daryl Griffith for the Jazz. Four out of ten. Peerless signatures for John Hooten and Utah, who I think who I think also made a lot of great moves this offseason. I think D'Lo, I think D'Angelo Russell probably will be traded, although per the rules, he can't be traded until like December or something like that. But he can be traded by by the trading deadline near the All Star break. Fourteen out of ninety nine, Nate Archibald. For the Kansas City Kings, which turned into the Sacramento Kings, Ken Goldberg. And this is going to be an interesting name right here. 55 out of 99, Michael Porter Jr. Three-color jersey and auto. See, this guy's healthy. That's another addition to the Nuggets. That could be really interesting. Ken Goldberg with the Nuggets. Nice. Yeah, it, it is true. I, I I do tend to follow the name on the front of the jersey as opposed to the back. You know, I think I think there's so, there's so much player movement these days. You know, I mean that's just kind of kind of the way culture has kind of shifted to. I think a lot of people who follow. Uh, a lot of people who follow like individual teams, you know, because so many sports athletes are becoming like individual brands, you know what I mean? But I stick with the team. I that's a good question. I'm not I'm not entirely sure. Does anyone else have a good answer for that? What's a good comparison for a healthy Michael Porter Jr.? What's a good comp? What could he be? There's Oscar Robertson. For the Cincinnati Royals. What did they turn into? Cincinnati. 
Did they turn into the Kansas City Kings? No, see, I don't think it's the Kings because I think it's the Kansas City Kings that turned into the Sacramento Kings. But the Cincinnati Royals turn into something else. Oh, no, they, well, okay, the Cincinnati, you're right, Cincinnati Royals went, became the Kansas City Kings, which then moved to uh, Sacramento in the mid-80s. So this is for the Kings, Ken Goldberg. I was thinking of a, thinking of a different old team. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. All right, and the last box. Good luck, everybody. We got... Carl Anthony Towns, 93 out of 99. Timberwolves, Ken. Fifty-seven out of ninety-nine. Triple relic. Colin Sexton. It's a nice one. Also for Ken. He's been on fire. Retro materials. Isaiah Thomas, 33 out of 99. Eric Bailey with the Pistons. And we've got Goran Dragic, who I think was going to be moved somewhere in that Jimmy Butler move. But I think he the money didn't end up working out. So I think it was Hassan Whiteside who ended up moving all the way to Portland. All sorts of craziness. And I think Goran Drogic is still in the heat. Still on the heat. Kevin G with the heat. We got for the Bulls. 20 out of 25. Chandler Hutchinson. Three color patch. Erickson Sala. And J.J. Reddick, 74 out of 99 for Sixers edition of J.J. Reddick. Kevin G. with Philadelphia. I think this was a good move by the Pelicans to pick up uh, J.J. Reddick. So J.J. Reddick with Drew Holiday, Brandon Ingram, Lonzo Ball, Zion. It's a pretty good addition. We got Kurt Rambis, Suns edition of Kurt Rambis, ninety out of ninety nine. Ken Goldberg with the Phoenix Suns. Game more material in there as well. Two more to go. Another old school guy, Dan Issel. 67 out of 99, Denver Nuggets. That's going to go to Ken Goldberg, finishing strong, Ken. And the last one is three-color jersey and autograph. It's Troy Brown Jr., 28 out of 99. Eric Bailey with the Wizards. You're a wizard, Eric. And there you have it, boys and girls. Another great case of NT basketball in the books. Fun stuff. Um, well, these, these, guys, these two sold out really fast on the website on jazbeescasebreaks.com. We'll try to pick up some more, so keep an eye on the website and uh, so you can check out some more NT hoops. Thanks, everyone. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.